Hi, my name is Adrian, and I am a medical esthetician. I have 20 years experience in doing skincare and I work for Dr. Cassano. And I'm hoping to help you out today with some issues with wearing a mask because we're all wearing them right now. We wear them here at Dr. Fasano's office because what it does is it keeps my breath to myself. So none of my germs leave this area. So it helps keep you safe. So we think it's really important around here to wear a mask to help keep you guys safe. And if you're like us and you're wearing a mask all the time, there may be some issues with that. So I want to just kind of help you out with that a little bit. So first things first, uh, we wear the surgical type masks here that are disposable. But um, if you're like me when I'm at home and you wear one of these really nice masks that everybody's making, the reusable masks, the first important tip is to wash it often. I also recommend using a clean and clear, no fragrance, no dye detergent because this is right next to your face. You're breathing it in and it's also touching your, your skin on your face. So it's important to keep it free of dyes and perfumes. Also, really important, do not use fabric softener on those masks. Uh, the fabric softener stays behind to keep that fabric soft and you don't want that on your face. Uh, it'll definitely make you break out. So after that, the next important thing is to wash your face with a really good cleanser every day after you take it off. Uh, we recommend Image Products. This one is organic, so it's got green tea and it's a really nice gentle cleanser that gets all the dirt and oil off but doesn't strip your skin. It's a really good one for the summer. Everybody loves this cleanser and this will help keep you from breaking out. Another thing that we might change for this mask wearing time is to add a serum that helps prevent breakouts but doesn't dry your skin out. So this is a serum that you could just use during this time of summer. We're sweating more, there's more humidity, and we're keeping it close to our face with these masks. So this is a really great serum for this time. Another tip that I usually give teenagers, but for now, it's really, this is what I'm doing. We have these pads, they're individual pads. Um, they have salicylic acid in them. So when I take my mask off, I just wipe it down with the salicylic acid with the pad and it also helps prevent breakouts. You're still gonna get some here and there, but if you do these things, it'll keep it to a minimum. Um, and it's just a good way to just focus on your skin with everything that's going on right now because we don't wanna stop wearing masks just because we're getting a breakout. Um, I also have, we do dermal, I do dermal infusion here. Dermal infusion is um, the best facial I've ever given and I've ever gotten. It does things simultaneously. So what it does is it sucks the junk out of your pores. So it uses suction to pull your skin up to a stainless steel tip with diamond, crushed diamonds. And it exfoliates the skin. It pushes the serum beneath the stratum corneum. It also does lymphatic drainage, which is good if you're having sinus or allergy issues right now. And you get to see what we get off of your skin in this nice little jar here. So I know we haven't been eating the best. Um, during quarantine and we haven't maybe been taking the best care of our skin. So this is a really great way to get your skin back in shape is by getting a nice hydrating exfoliating facial. Your skin feels and looks amazing when you're done. It doesn't hurt. It actually feels good. You also get a mask um, and you'll love it. Everybody loves it. I've never had anybody only come in once for this. They always want to come back. Another important thing is to just don't wear makeup on the bottom half of your face. I have no makeup on the bottom half of my face. The only thing I have on is sunscreen. You should put on sunscreen every day regardless. Um, but I have no makeup on the bottom of my face. My eyes are what is being shown every day, so I do my eyes. I do not have any bronzer, no foundation, no lip gloss, nothing on this part of my face. Otherwise, the mask is just gonna keep it in there and it's gonna irritate everything. Stay safe and come see us because we are making sure that you stay healthy when you are in our office.